Let f of x equals x squared. What is the area under this curve in the interval 0 to 2? Use n equals 4 rectangles with the top right vertex on f of x. So what does this mean in terms of a diagram? So from 0 to 2, we're going to split up into four equal parts and draw vertical lines up until we get to the graph. Next, since we want the top right vertex to be on f of x, from the tip of each of these vertical lines, we're going to draw a line to the left and draw straight down. So now we have four rectangles, each with top right vertex on f of x. To find the area on the curve, we're finding all of these green areas, which is area on the curve, but because these are rectangles, we also have all these red areas as well. So the area that we're going to find is going to be called an overestimated area. All right. To find the area algebraically, well, the width of each rectangle on 0 to 2 with n equals 4 rectangles, meaning that width is equal to 2 minus 0 over 4, which is 1 half or 0.5. Now, we'll create a table of values starting with x equals 0 with a width of 0 0.5. We're going to constantly add by 0 0.5 until we get to x equals 2. Now, we're going to evaluate. Since f of x equals x squared, then we have all of these corresponding f of x values. To find the area of these rectangles, we're just going to add up all four of these areas together. Notice that each of them has a base of 0.5 and a height of 0.25, 1, 2.25, and 4. What I'm going to do is I'm going to factor out 0.5 and notice that we're left with these blue portion, which is from the table. Add them all up, you get 0.5 times 7.5, which simplifies to 3.75. So this is an overestimated area. All right. So the 0.5 considered as the width of each rectangle where the 7.5 is the sum of the heights of each rectangle. So our overestimate area is the width of each rectangle times the sum of the heights of each rectangle. Come like, subscribe. Thank you.